Hey, 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 guys, this is Hawkeye, and I am back with another episode of Fallout Shelter. Now, guys, I had uh, actually completed an episode before this one, and I don't know what happened. Somehow I either lost the footage or got corrupted. I'm not sure, but there were so many things that happened in it, and it really, really ticks me off that it happened. Anyway... I have been sending a bunch of my people out on quests, and I'm trying to build up my money and my loot. And I managed to pick up a few more lunch boxes along the way. And when I did so, I managed to get this guy. Check it out. I got a Mr. Handy. Yay! <laughs> I really wanted him. Yeah, he's, uh, he's going to be very useful. I've kind of got him up here. To help guard things. I know you can send him out to collect resources. I haven't done that just yet. But he has, you know, obviously complete immunity to any types of radiation and whatnot. So, and he's a, he's great in a fight. I will say that. Also, let me show you, show you some of these other guys. Check out this guy. James, apparently he's what they call a legendary dweller i don't know how the heck i managed to get him but look at his stats i mean he is just like rocking with his stats he's a level 42 i stuck him in the clinic because he he literally with his the outfit he's wearing tops out as a 10 or full in the intelligence so that only makes sense yeah all these guys seem to be very very happy i've got oh, like Four of them, five, six, seven, several of them at level 12 now. And I think I got another one that had another guy that had pretty high stats. I'm trying to find him right now. Yeah, this Emil King. Yeah, he had some pretty good stats too. Now, he was only a level 10, but his stats are awesome. I've got him. I think I've got. Where do I have him? power plant well yeah that makes sense his, his agility is pretty high I guess I mean strength I've got I'm kind of contemplating putting him down here in the food just because the food production is going down a little bit the only reason I liked having him up there is because he had such massive stats that I figured he'd be good in a fight but with Mr. Handy up there now that's not really an issue again everything's still in the green I've been upgrading things the broadcasting room has been upgraded uh, it's brought in like two or three more dwellers that's why I'm up to 26 now I put in some elevators because I'm gonna start expanding out this direction put some rooms over here as well yeah, I was trying to decide should I go down or should I go up, and I think I'm going to go this way for now, and then I'll start going down. But, going to need elevators to get everywhere, and I think having elevators on both sides is going to make it easier for people to get up and down, or robots in this case too. But, yeah, it's, it's really been going pretty good. I need to put in one more elevator right here at the broadcasting station. In fact, I'll go ahead and do that. There. Now we... Oh, shoot. We got a rad roach. In. Don't worry about it. Gary will take care of it. And if he doesn't, somebody else will. I kind of stuck him in there because he kind of really didn't know what to do. He was one of the one of the new fellas. Let's see. who. Yeah, Jacob has a pretty good weapon. I'm going to bring him over here. Oh, shoot. Apparently the mysterious stranger appeared and I missed him. Dang on it. 
Yeah, let's bring him over. Whoop. Let's bring him over here too. Maybe he can help. Ooh, gosh, his health's getting down. All right, they took care of it. Yeah, the only thing is, as you get higher levels, uh, more damage, things like rad roach invent, uh, infestations and fire seem to do to your people. So I have to kind of regularly go down and check to make sure that everybody's health is all right. A couple of them are down almost to half, but yeah, Gary's, he needs a little bit of a boost there. I like Gary. I don't know why. He's just—he's just one of my favorites. I love that outfit. I just love it, and I like my new Mr. Handy. I—I I wonder if you can name him something else. I guess you can't. What's this? I guess collect. What does that mean? I don't know. Well, I'll. Maybe that means he'll work in the place. I don't know. I'll figure it out. I'm still learning this stuff, guys. It's it's not easy. But one of the reasons I brought you here, guys, is I'm not going to go on a quest just yet. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a few more things because I've unlocked a whole bunch of things. And I wanted to save it for the next episode after that quest mission, which I flubbed up terribly. But... We have the weapon workshop, which assigns dwellers here to qu you can assign them there to craft weapons, weight room, and this can train their strength, athletics room to train their agility, and eventually we'll get to the armory. Now that's what I, I can't wait for, but the weapon's going to be great. I think, what weapons do I have now? I, I think I was able to pick up some that I haven't assigned yet, but I'm not sure. Let me see here. Uh, well, I have an enhanced sawed-off shotgun. Eh, these aren't all that wonderful, but I might as well go ahead and arm some of these people. Oh, this was it. This was it. This was it. I, I got a T-60A power armor. Yes, that's what I was trying to remember. Oh, my God, yeah. That was right. I got it on one of those missions. Check it out, guys. I've got to figure out who I'm going to give it to. I just haven't decided. I don't know who to give it to. I mean, I mean, James is already maxed out pretty good. Billy Hancock's pretty. He's up there now. A lot of his stats are based on his outfit, but I would rather it be a level 12 at least, because some of these require people to have higher stats let me Gary's not doing too good um, huh I don't know Keith Bush Lawrence see Lawrence doesn't have all that great the thing is Maria Bishop and Doris Sanders, they do a lot of work in the lab. And you know what? Charlotte Martin is, for some reason, I just always liked her. I keep, I used to send her out on missions all the time. I don't know why. I just really like her. She was probably the one that went on the most uh, explorations out on the wasteland. And you know what? I think I'm going to give her that. I think I'm going to give it to her. There she is. <laughs> yes, I love it. Check her out. She is in power armor. That is pretty cool. That'll toughen her up. Now, when we get a mission, I'm going to be sending her. That's that's a guarantee. Yeah, the clergy one, I took off of one of these guys. But now that we've got some charisma here, I think I'm going to give it to somebody that needs a job. I think, see, let me see here. Who needs a job? Who's got fairly high charisma? Things keep updating here. Maybe David Warner. 
No. Is there anybody not working? <laughs> I think everybody's got a job. I don't see anybody just wandering around. Well, Edward Perry is one of the uh, new guys. Maybe I'll give it to him. Anyway, I think I will distribute some of those in a little bit here, guys. But right now, I want to build some rooms. All right, I think what I'm going to do is these, this one here I'm going to leave alone only because if I decide that I need to enhance or build more power rooms, I want to go across this direction. I think the med bay is good enough for now. Uh, same with the living quarters. I might want to go that direction a little bit. So I think what I'm going to do is put it down here. Well, I don't know, guys. I'm, I'm kind of. I think I'll put it next to the storage room. Actually, that's what I'll do. All right, let's see here. The weapons workshop. All right. Rem rem remember to destroy a rock. That's not what I wanted to do here, guys. No more space available for construction? Really? Alright, guys. I think I got it figured out. Apparently, the weapons room takes three whole spaces. So, it has to go underneath the broadcasting room. There's no option to take it to the right or to the left. Which is unfortunate, but... That's the way it is, apparently. That's the only place, oh, either there or probably over here, possibly. But that would make the most sense right here. Alright, so it's time to start crafting. Here are some recipes and junk to make a weapon and an outfit you can only get through crafting. So this is what you've been collecting all that junk for. Many other items cannot be found, only crafted. When choosing what to craft, these are marked by the crafting icon. Here's a recipe for you. A pipe rifle. Cool. <laughs> Here's a recipe for you. Oh, Brotherhood of Steel uniform. Nice. All right. So what does this... Oh, good God. He's back again. Where is he? I don't see him, guys. I don't see him. Ah! Lost him. That darn guy, I swear to God, he pops up at the worst possible times. Let me see here, guys. I need to find somebody. See, I don't know what the... Let me borrow her. Let's see how this works. I'll take her down. Let her do a little finagling in there and see what she can do. In her little power suit. <laughs> Oh, I love it. This is so cool, guys. Oh! Come on, Charlotte. I need you to take care of this situation. He can't hurt you. I mean, they're rad. Bro. Well, he's still doing some damage to her. Jeez. Oh, surprise. Come on, Gary. I need your help down here. Come on. I need your help. I need your help. I need help. I need help. There we go. All right, we're good. Damn red roaches. Sorry, Charlotte. Anyway, how? Let's see, craft. Okay. So we unlock the pipe rifle. And here's a couple other recipes. It looks like. We can do the pipe rifle, which is six, one damage. You need a fan and one of those things. Malon pistol, BB gun. What's the highest weapon you can craft here? Sawed off shotgun. Well, nothing's really fantastic, I guess. I guess the rusty. 
see this shows right here that I only have six of one to make the parts that I need well, maybe not Yeah, I want to craft one of those just to see. All right, she's crafting. There we go. Ooh, looks like I got some points here. So now make four friends in the wasteland. Kill 15 creatures in the wasteland and sell five weapons or outfits so at some point we can start selling outfits alright we still have plenty of cash on hand so I think it's time to make a weight room so we can increase people's strength now this can go just about anywhere now I don't know if there is a limitation on this direction or not but I think The weight room I'm going to put, ah uh, gosh, yeah I'll go ahead and put it down here. I'm just afraid it's going to block something that I really need to expand out. That's my problem. Because you may not be able to build beyond this. I don't think you can. I'll just put it right here. I hope I'm doing that right. And the other one is um, the athletics room. And I think I'm going to put it. Well, you can't really expand the overseer's office any more than. So I'm just going to put it right here. So let's see. Train your dwellers to increase their special stats. So this is for increasing agility. So let me find somebody who has very low agility. Like Keith Bush has terrible agility. And someone else. Wait a minute. Let's go ahead and... Go down here. Yes, I finally learned how to do this. Noah Myers. Okay, Noah has terrible agility. He has great strength, but low agility. So what we're going to do is we're going to bring him down here. Get his athletics, athleticism up. And let's find somebody who has terrible strength. Uh, let's see, Charlotte Green has low strength. I like Charlotte. Charlotte needs to be stronger. But I also like Doris. She works in the restaurant. I think I'm going to leave her be. Amy, she's another one I like. I think I'm going to pick her because I just like her. Where did, where did she go? I lost her. Ah, oh, there he is again. Guys, do you see him? I don't see him. There he is. Ha 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 ha! Got him. Yes. Little bastard. Well, I got distracted by the by the guy. Uh, where'd she go? Where'd she go? Amy Wright. There she is. Yeah, I'm gonna build her strength. Well, apparently I didn't. Yeah, you gotta make sure that highlights, otherwise they don't actually go. Alright, looks like she's gonna be working on that for a while. I'm gonna go ahead and give her a little bit of a boost in her health there, because she's gonna be working on that a while. Happiness is 83%. That's not as high as it's been, but it's not bad. So, guys, we've got people working out. We've got people working on their strength, working on their agility. 
And I think that's all we've got available at this point. We've got an armory here that's going to unlock once I get 28 dwellers. And I'm working hard at getting that level up. I did upgrade the broadcasting room. I have, I think, three dwellers in here right now. Yeah. And all of four dollars. All of them have high charisma. So they're working on it. But usually, I think what it means this time here, that's about how long it takes to actually make contact to somebody. But we have plenty of room. I think we can actually take on 34 dwellers at this point. If I upgrade living quarters, we can take on even more. Alright, what's your deal, guy? Okay, I can take him down to the broadcasting room as well. Alright guys, it looks looks like everything's going pretty good. I think we need one more person here because the food... Eh, nah, we're good. We're all good. And we're already up to 85%. Haven't had a raider attack for a while. But I've got Mr. Handy here just itching to shoot somebody with a flame. So I think we're in good shape, guys. I think we're in good shape.